from Hendo letting you know that you should subscribe to Ray's Chaos because he's a dope guy. Everybody, my name is Race Chaos. You've made it back to my channel on a Wednesday, and you know what that means when it's a Wednesday. It means Race has got a new comic book cover, and you know how he loves comic book covers. And today we have, boom, we have got another issue of Avengers, which is easily the the most of any title they've put out. Uh, they've done more Avengers covers than any other anything else um that's like the one thing that they've done the most of and uh that actually so far includes wolverine <laughs> uh as they've done as far as characters goes they've done wolverine more than anybody but as far as comic series goes they've done more issues of avengers than any other series thus far which is kind of deserving considering that they did put that out that since that was such a long-standing thing a lot of stuff happened in avengers and um still screaming for dc to get on the ball come on let's get some more out there i want more but we're gonna go ahead and put this guy away and have a look at this so yeah avengers number 109 Nice little cover here. It's got Hawkeye ripping his, uh, tearing his bow in half, tearing the bow up, which is really well done in the sculpt here. Um, that tears it. I've had it as an Avenger right here. And now Hawkeye's cutting out. And uh, yes, he quits in this issue, uh, <laughs> which uh, if you're kind of curious as to why, um, Little tidbit, uh, Captain America's on this cover. He's not in this issue. <laughs> but yeah, if you look at the cover, you've got Scarlet Witch, you've got uh, Black Panther, you've got Iron Man. Um, you would think, if you've got Scarlet Witch, Black Panther, and Iron Man on a team, what do you need a guy with a bow and arrow? <laughs> what do you need with him? Um, which, that is not the reason that he's leaving. Oddly enough, the reason that he leaves, <laughs> what gets his goat, is basically he sees the romance starting between uh, Scarlet Witch and Vision, and he get, starts getting super jealous. He's got this whole, you know, what the heck? He's a robot, and like, he's beat me out. And uh, he essentially gets put off by this. Uh, changes into his uh, older costume, which, um, yeah, it's not the costume that he was wearing uh, the issue before, and he takes off. Leaves a note and everything. He's just gone. Um, <laughs> the, according to the writer Steve Englehart, uh, the reason he had Hawkeye go was pretty much for the reasons I said earlier, because... He was the writer. He was like, Hawkeye's neither good. Hi Hawkeye's neither bad. He's just kind of there. And he didn't know what to do with him. And uh, so that's why he essentially wrote him off the team for a while. So a lot of times, uh, roster changes have less to do with what the characters are doing and more mostly to do with the writers. Um, if they can't think of anything, there's really no point in keeping the character on there. Um, and yeah, that's how that worked out. Um, <laughs> it is a great cover. I love the fact that it's got, uh, Hawkeye tearing a bow or breaking the bow. Um, and the figure really, really exemplifies that. I mean, that's, it's probably one of the best, uh, figure portrayals in these comic book covers. 
uh, which there are pretty good ones. There, there are great ones. And Hawkeye, so far, as far as the comic covers go, he's got two of the best. Because if you recall, the last one was him with uh, Ant-Man on the arrowhead, and he was getting ready to shoot it, um, which is absolutely, I mean, that was a great cover. This is a great cover. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, this is another part of the, Avengers Beyond Earth or Beyond Earth's Mightiest collection, um, Target exclusive. Uh, Target's been really pumping these things out like crazy, so you gotta love that. And uh, I'm see, I'm 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 dying here because I have read this issue and I've read before, I've read on, and I know what happens. In this, and he really does leave. I think he turns up in the next issue, and then after that, they kind of mention Hawkeye leaving. Um, but he really does leave the team um, for such a ridiculous reason. But uh, big clue though is that when Scarlet Witch gets the note that uh, that Hawkeye has left, the goodbye, I'm leaving, whole deal. Um, he signs at Hawkeye. He doesn't sign at Clint. So there's a big clue as to what's coming in that one. But you're just going to have to read that story to figure it out. Because I'm not going to give that away. I give away enough as it is. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. Let me know if you've read this issue. Let you let me know if you know the surprise that uh, this essentially leads into. And <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, this whole storyline, it just, you know... He, that leads to uh, Black Canary coming back. I'm not telling you the big one, but like, yeah, like soon after this, the X-Men uh, team up with the Avengers. He meets, they meet uh, the uh, Magneto again. Um, but it all like kind of is working towards something. So I'm going to go ahead and get out, get out of here before I start ruining crap for everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Click like on this video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new here. And uh, if you enjoy these uh, these comic book covers, I've got a whole playlist full of them. I get every one I can as they come out, except for the Star Wars. Um, but uh, go ahead, leave me a comment below. Let me know if you've seen this. And uh, hope to see you back here with another comic cover as soon as I can possibly get one. So I'm going to get out of here. Have a great day, and never forget that life is full of odd moments, and you never know when you're going to be defined.